Hi everyone, I'm Zoe Cannell reporting for Kids First and today I'll be reviewing the Casa Grande the Nickelodeon TV series. I love this series. I've been watching The Loud House for a while and then Ronnie Ann, the main character, started popping up here and there and then before I knew it, the Casa Grandes was made. Um, this is, I honestly just, I really like this series and I think this is such a cool series. It's definitely a spin-off from The Loud House. Um, it's kind of this Latina family and I feel like that's actually important as well. So The Loud House is more of English and then here you have like a different kind of version of The Loud House. I actually got the chance to interview Isabella Alvarez and Ali Brooks. Um, Ali Brooks is a surprise character who's coming up in a new episode. She also helped sing the theme song. And then Isabella Alvarez plays Ronnie Ann, the main character, and she also rapped in the theme song that they're going to put in for the Casa Grandes. The Casa Grandes is basically a TV show where this girl Ronnie Ann is always doing fun stuff with her best friend and she has this whole crazy family and they're always doing their own stuff and ep every episode is different and has a new thing that Ronnie Ann is doing or a new obstacle hookup that she has to face. Since I've been watching La Casa Grandes for a while now, it, I've discovered that it's actually very hard <laughs> to choose a favorite episode because they're all different in so many different ways, but they're all unique. Um, I think one of my favorite so far is one that actually hasn't come out yet. I wish I could talk about it, but I can't. But the newest episode that's going to come out is the one I really enjoy watching. So you guys should make sure to check it out on Nickelodeon. Every episode always goes out at 11.30 a.m. I think that the music in the series is one of the things that definitely brings it to life because it kind of really represents the Latino in the series. And since this is animation, it's important to have a good color palette because without colors, it's not really fun to watch even though you have everything else going on but I love the colors in the Casa Grandes it's like turquoise and purple and blue and all these fun different colors that it just it makes it brings a pop into the series which I thought was like I think the color palette in this series is very good I think Isabella Alvarez did an amazing job in the voice acting um, she's actually 15 and she's playing an 11 year old girl and it's high it's hard to match your voice to a character that's younger than you if your voice doesn't stretch that high or low or it just depends on the character but I think she definitely is nailing it and it's very believable too I actually didn't know that she was 15 I would think that she's also an 11 year old girl I actually got the opportunity to interview Ali Brooks and Isabella Alvarez if I didn't already say that and they're super nice. You should make sure to check it out. It's on Kids First right now. I would give this TV series a 4 out of 5 stars and recommend it for ages up to 13. So thank you guys all so much for watching. If you liked it, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Check out some of our other Kids First reviewers and reporters. Goodbye! The Casa Grandes, a brand new show, coming soon to Nick.